Okay, so for this question here, it says solve for the unknown side length, round your answers to two decimal places. Okay, well, I'm just looking for Q here. So because this is set up as the sine law, I'm going to cross multiply. And so that would be Q times the sine of 80 degrees is going to equal, sorry, I don't know why there's a little kind of decimal there, is equal to 10.0 times the sine of 30 degrees. And then to get the Q by itself, I would divide both sides by that sine of 80. It's going to just look like this. So now my calculator, it's 10 multiplied by the sine of 30 divided by the sine of 80. Looks like I get 5.1 or 5.077. Oh, actually, i got to go to the nearest hundredth here. 5.077. Uh, 7, 7 is going to round to 5.08. The answer is C.